I got to admit, I never thought I'd see this place again. Even with the furniture, it's not the same without them. Harvey, why did you want me to meet you here? Mike asked me to rent it out for them when they left. I never did. Oh, it must have cost them a fortune. It didn't cost them a thing. I created a fake tenant. Been paying rent ever since. In case they came back. I know it sounds crazy, but... It's not crazy. You know, I'm glad that Lewis interrupted us the other morning. <laughs> you are? Yeah. Gave me time to realize I have more to tell you. Like about this apartment? It used to remind me of all the things I've lost. But now, it reminds me of all the things you've helped me accept. What do you mean? I mean, a week ago, I never would have come over knowing that you were still with Thomas. But that night, I didn't even think about it. Because once it hit me that we should be together, it felt like we've always been together. Uh-oh, you're gonna make me cry. I'm just getting started. I thought I was gonna lose everything at that hearing. And then I didn't. But I felt empty. And then I won. And you weren't there. What I'm trying to say is that night, everything finally made sense. I'm finally where I'm supposed to be. We both are. <laughs> what? Guess whose name I put on the fake lease? Rick Sorkin. Oh my God, that's the kid who didn't show up for his interview the day you hired Mike. See? That's what I love about you. You get me. Love about me. <laughs>